What's up guys, this is the Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Napoleon Total War Let's Play as Great Britain. So to run off happened last time, we've engaged some French armies in central France defending our gains and we've also spotted Napoleon Bonaparte. He has finally been identified, you guys. And I've got my cavalry troops up in the high hills near France keeping an eye on what's being done to the city. So yeah, so I've got this army is replenishing. Well actually I might even move them onto... No, I want to keep them here because just in case some army, the French decide to move up troops along this road, I don't have a good don't have a good view on what's going on going on in that region. Um, but we also fought a large battle here, but under Alexander Abercrombie, very very good battle, well fought here. And Wellington is moving up, and he's probably going to head straight towards this bridge and hold. Ideally, this chances are this army will be used to clear up these guys, and this army will go up and take Khan. I also have another army here, the George Townshend Walker, being recruited in London. London itself is experiencing massive redevelopment, which is good. Then this army here, under Sir John, uh, Sir John Moore, is going to head east into Torino and Milan. At a certain point, I want to do a bit more building and a bit more um, rebuilding in that area. And we also had a rather unfortunately destructive auto resolve battle where i lost six ships which is not good at all um at the end of the last part i did say i want to keep to check i want to upgrade the infrastructure of both of these regions because they are actually shrinking they're actually losing money well discontent but that should go down i'd hope so let's hit end turn and see what happens i want bonaparte to head my no he's heading east well, I suppose, yes, yay, he's heading east. Ah, oh, damn AI. They always do some sneaky... Oh, yeah, I want to f blow the hell out of some French columns. Why not? Sometimes you just want to shoot the crap out of some Frenchmen. You don't need preserves. Not when your line is massive. Oh, so we're actually just going to fight them on the open field. Oh, okay. Well, all my guns go over here. Probably fairly out of the way. And then to meet them head on, I want my strongest infantry units. Meet them head on. Send skirm skirmishes on the right. The rest of my infantry on the left. Let's get my general staff, the Earl of Uxbridge, everyone on the left. I want to run them because I don't. Never, being tired doesn't seem to. It's never been that much of a big deal. Keep running. And let's do. Let's get my general, everyone up on the flank. Sorry, guys. I took this fight expecting and wanting a mighty fight. Actually gonna hit my British Marines, the Black Watch, and some Highland foot units on the left first. These men will have the honour of engaging first. Cavalry is going to sit here. See, if they went in for an assault, they'd have a really good shout. As it is, 
they're going to be engaged from every possible direction simultaneously. Okay, it's pulling you back because they're starting to to flee. The morale is strong. Well, it was strong. Glorious victories, huh? It's soon to be yours. All of my horse, all of my cavalry go for the, the attacking column. Everyone go for this French unit. Well, you're just going to go for that one then. Sir, sir, our general is under attack. Good. For one horrible minute, I thought that was mine. Pull my general back. Let's run him out this way. Let's halt fire. And then let's just halt fire with everybody. Are there any infantry there at all? Straight into the column of attack. Chase them down. Absolutely continue. Let's run the my run my general over here. Good, that should be the last of that unit. Oh no, there's a guy. Oh, there he is. There's the last. Then my general's going to run down this unit. Or, no, it won't completely run it down. But hell, he's getting himself some fighting credentials. Him and his staff slaughtering, surrendering men. Or routing men. Oh... Pick a side and go for it. Ah, whew. I can understand, but at the same time, they're not even garrisoning. Ah, just... What is their determination to, to garrison this bridge? To garrison this port? It's just unit after unit probably where they're going to go now. But it is. That's absolutely where they're going to go. Uh-oh. The French Navy. Enemy fleet ahead. So who is it? A brig and a frigate. The fleet is lost. Enemy. He's going to go on a bit of a... That's fair enough. Those ones I did range lost. a bit far out from my protection there Disengage. 
Oh, they're going to upgrade their port. Interesting. Hmm. So, just going to say it right now. I'm the one doing the heavy lifting against France. No one else is really chipping in that much. Oh, Spy network established in Cannes. Perfect. Let's build a mine. So I'm sure the AI did something sneaky and I'm just missing it. Court of Appeals. Yeah, this army's replenishing slowly. I can't really get any special infantry, so... To be honest, I might buy some... Some more artillery, because I seem to be... Well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Seven units, so four, five, six... Let's get another unit. Let's get another unit of light infantry, I suppose. Fleet destroyed. Those are my trade ships. Cobbled roads in Cardiff. Let's upgrade them, and let's go down and upgrade cobbled roads in one of these regions, which makes more money. Toulouse makes more money. So here, metal roads. Sorry. Let these guys replenish for a turn or so. Can I recruit any sort of Let's recruit some dragoons to do a bit of scouting for me to see what's up ahead. General available, Henry Clinton. Lovely. Traits gained, supplies in government, strong defender, and obviously Bob Crawford is a drill master. He's known for it in reality. Yeah, more, more um, merchant ships. I'm just going to keep them there because there's no real need to move them. All right, let's hit end turn. Yeah, you. Oh, that that was the guy I missed. So what are you, Regiment de Catalan? Hmm. Feel free to run. Oh God! Stop! Let me replenish my army, damn it! But that little cavalry unit sat over just over the hill is is quite a quite a useful little tool. The Austrian the Turkish have Istanbul by the looks of it. Not the Turkish. The Russians. Obviously it makes sense if the Turkish had Istanbul. Mm hmm. It's gonna be more meat for the future British Empire. Top gallants have been researched. Spy network established. Uh, Reliable. He's been able to provide you with a steady stream of intelligence. And it's similar about Lisbon. Perfect. Oh, look at that. Scouting not required, but it's too late because I've already bought you. Francois Marie Garnier. Jeremy Legendre. Be honest, let's send. We'll send you out to the bridge. Let's let's rebuild the. We've got a bit more of you. You want to get two more units of artillery, which is nice. It's my little. Oh, that was my other little navy, wasn't it? Let's move. Oh no, that's not mine at all. 
Let us have a look at what's going on. So Naples is Naples, Rome is the Papal States, Milan, Torino, Innsbruck. Yeah, sorry Greece, at some point you gotta go. Same with you, Sardinia, at some point you gotta go. Palma is ready to grow, so let's do a... Spend a lot of money on Palma, which I probably don't need to do. And let's upgrade um, Spain, because ultimately I'm going to have to recruit an army there at some point to go back and fight the Portuguese, probably, because what's the Portuguese diplomatic position like? Friendly, the only ally with me, I'm not at war with anyone. I haven't repaired my dockyard. Sail out and then go in because they're recruiting a frigate. Ultimately, I probably could send this army up to take Khan, but I'd like some more replenishment because right now, yeah, this well, this region is not very good for replenishment, so they need to take it slow. They need to be a bit more measured in their approach. Ah, so we finally got a first court of appeals in London. Dialectics, tech research rate, diplomatic. Relations, that's really good. Semaphore lines, plus line of sight, very, very good. Okay. So let's go for this with Oxford, instead of carronades, because I'm not bothered about getting carronades. Schleswig will carry on, because am I currently building... A military Academy? I need to build an engineer school as soon as possible. Give me a rocket troop. There we go. Let's probably get... Spend my money on a couple of third rates to go to Nelson. I want to see where Bonaparte pops up. You form a little French army over there. Well, you're going to go get smashed by the Duke of Wellington. Oh, God, another... Stop it! Chomp. See, somehow I lost 303 men doing that. Same again. Everyone's just having units. Everyone's just having units shaved off of them. Well, they're going to be engaged by this army to the southwest. Wellington's going to head east and hit that army forming to the eastern edge of Paris, eastern edge of the Paris region. Next turn, my army will come over and hit Caen. So there'll be three up to four stacks ready to rock and roll against Paris, which ultimately doesn't look like it'll be needed because the garrison of Paris has been defeated on the field other way in other places. But I hope that Bonaparte does something cool on the Eastern Front. Got a spy in Catalonia. Let's send you to Strasbourg. Salamanca is a secret society. Couple of roads in Oren. That should help with re replenishment a bit. Yeah, a little bit. Recruitment port. Yeah. So, let's get these 106 gun frigates. It's the Mary Rose. <laughs> let's get the Mary Rose over to Nelson. Spend a bit more money to fix all of his ships. Let's upgrade it to a steam dry dock. Ooh, very elite unit. 12 pound of full artillery, heavy cavalry reserve. I wish I could have a better look at what you are. I'm going to send one cavalry unit east. Let's upgrade the merchant house and let's send a cavalry unit up here. Let's 
So if I engage this unit, it will draw this army. Is that Marshal Ney? Marshal Ney himself? It will draw him into the battle. I think I might do that yeah. now. Jeffra Mirabeau, call in your ally. See, so yeah, I bring in Marshal Ney. Some heavy horse guards. Some good infantry. But I've got a very elite unit, a very elite force. Accuracy 44 compared to the best you guys got. Accuracy 36. Let's attack. So we want to move up and... Oh, no, there's a town in the way. Well, still move up and get ready to form a, a welcoming committee for the French... French... So then we are... So there's a road. It's a road north to south. Okay, so we want to focus on the left-hand side. Let's keep my artillery away. Solid core of foot infantry. And let's keep King's German Legion, Highland Foot and Light Foot to take up any defensive positions on the right as needed first light horse is going to be here i'm not looking to, to annihilate them i'm looking to just get into a good position ah there so they are actually coming in right opposite me it's actually pretty useful in which case then you guys are going to form a reserve behind the guns. Fire will turn off. And you guys under unit three. Very deep um, infantry line. You may try push into the city, but if you do, I'll just spin my flank around to get into a better position, a better firing position. Like, I'll bend these units. I don't know, actually. Actually, I might steal one of these units. Steal the light foot. And then let's take this area and stretch it like so instead. Cavalry is entering the field. Piecemeal. So this is it's the previous French general we've already seen, but this is Marshal Ney. Who I will be looking to kill. So let's speed this up a bit. Sorry, the strongest guns, they are still very capable. Because here comes the enemy guns. So let's speed up time. So they've regrouped, so I'm probably going to want to do something like this.
I suppose ultimately I don't want them to have space to deploy in the field, so... To be honest, I might actually might be okay just to set up my artillery to plink at a distance, spend a few barrages to keep packing at them. Because their infantry will enter the field and they'll probably get here quicker than I imagine they will. Oh, my artillery should be within range. Doing the last infantry unit's kink in position. Well, I should probably like them to be just a bit in front of these woods, actually. Just for my own sanity. Because their artillery is bugged, the generals are freaking out. Oh no, they have been engaging me. It's a nice fresh set shell scrape. There we go, everyone's in position. Spread my guys out a bit more. run these guys into position. Run these guys over here. This is where the first shots will be fired. The Lancers are, ch are they charging? Let's see if they kill any of their own men. Okay, let's target some of my artillery independently. Two of you guys target 12 pounders. You target them. My guys are probably in charge of the flank, but I don't really care at the minute. Seek the shelter of the inside of their square. So who's that? It's heavy. It's horse guard. Barrage, that unit of horse guards. Poor swines. Chosen the wrong target. Fortunately, my guys can't hit. The hell? I hit the 12 pounders, you hit the 12 pounders. See, hiding my light foot in the centre of the square. It's going rather well. Let's 
So what happens when you deploy your forces piecemeal? And with any luck in a random shot, we might actually hit. Oh, gun team down. First horse guard is coming straight into the minute, straight up the centre. Just maximising my firepower here. Danger close, so focus your fire centrally. So let's take these two guys, king around to join the fight. Let's bring them to engage there. Let's engage you, put you guys into the line. Could fire square, but not really. No, could form, could fire canister, but wow, that was a straight through into them. You know what, I might actually fire canister. Come on, rout your swines, you're getting close. Toggle the barrage. Bring my light dragoons back. Okay, let's try this. I've never actually had to do this before. Oh, is that permanent? Oh no, these guys are ready to go. Let you equip your guns. Maybe behind you, guns. Who's that? While well, they're routing and broken, that's fine. God, this has been a very sloppy battle indeed. Regiment going to go and try to get into close range. Very close combat against the 10th Regiment of Foot. Ooh. My men, however, are significantly more accurate. Okay, now you can do it. Regiment Hibernia, just, just open up. To be honest, let's send these guys just on a little mission to walk up to the, uh, to the artillery, the Royal 18th. Let's send three units of foot artillery, foot infantry up here as well. So ultimately, I feel it will not be necessary to win. Oh, fire will. Snipers. Skirmishers. Yeah, broken under your excellent shooting. Oh, the first Lightfoot reunion battalion. So I'm just going to spin you around and engage. Let's move these guys up. Here are all my horses of the artillery team is just bugging out. Not well, bugging out isn't breaking, bugging out isn't running away. So 
to be honest, where's my cavalry? There they are. Let's get all of them to pick howitzers and aim for just towards the rear. So charge them, not them. Oh, they killed killed the general of the other army of the other oh no of the, of the first army the small army to run. The 7th Regiment of Foot. 7th, the 3rd and the 2nd. Form square, damn it. Not you, you've still got time. We have killed their general, sir. Now they must break. Okay, let's hold the artillery. Who was that? That was Ney! And he was killed charging a unit of charging two British units in square. There's a delicious, delicious irony there. Charge the units. Square for well, charge their guns before they reload. Bunch of charging, furious Highlanders straight for their guns. Charge them before they can't move the guns. Well, let's just triple speed it, because it's just one battery of gunners against all of my men. They have fled the field. X. As Lord Chesterfield said of the generals of his day, I only hope that when the enemy reads, reads the list of the names, he trembles as I do. Ooh, lovely. Let's secure the town of Claremont. And then you go up and hit them. Let's do that. Oh god, I lost more men than you did. That's not great. Um, but anyway, looking at the timer, I think that's the end of this part. So, thanks for watching guys, I hope you've enjoyed, and I will see you next time.